What is going on you guys? It is Caveman here. Welcome to a brand new series of Arch Scorchers. Oh boy, this looks a whole lot different than where we were before, you guys. Oh boy. Man, we got some bugs flying around here. I'm pretty sure these guys are chill. Either way, we need to get going ASAP, you guys, because the desert is one dangerous place. Oh boy! Let me tell you what, and wow, there's our first death right off spot. Oh boy, you guys. Well, let me tell you, Scorched Earth is definitely going to be a different series. <laughs> that is for sure. Well, let's spawn over here at this other easy zone. <laughs> let's see if we can just find an area where we can, you know, get going off spawn and not casually get murdered by some saber tooth or anything else because there are so many dangers to find in this world. But um, either way, let's just get going, you guys. And yeah, of course, so Ark had a huge update, you know, to add Scorched Earth. Let me go ahead and pull up my patch notes here. And, um, yeah, do we have enough to craft anything yet? No, we need to go punch a tree real quick, so let's do that. But um, yeah, so I had an update. Of course, we added Scorched Earth, you know, adding all the new dinos back from Scorched Earth. I guess the old new dinos. The dragons, of course. Um, the death worms. The rock golems. And they added a brand new dinosaur called the... Um, I, I don't even know how to pronounce that. We're just going to call it... The a new crocodile thing because <laughs> it looks like a crocodile but um yeah either way yeah so of course they added all of that and then on top of that bob's tail tall tails got added in with scorched earth so we've got a brand new dinosaur the oasis or you guys which is a giant creature that you can live on top of basically a living oasis is literally you know the way to describe it so that's gonna be a beastly creature if we spot that here today but um so on top of that they also added a train as well as some new structures in the bob's tall tail dlc pack so we'll have to get into all that here later this series but um let's just get going you guys let's try to set ourselves up a base here day one hopefully tame something too because we are going to need a companion in this hostile desert world and oh we need to level up um you know first and as you can see here let me show them off real quick we got a little bit more of a, you know, a hairier caveman look for this series got the locks out if you will so i like the brand new look of our character here for this but um i know we gotta find oh i was gonna say we gotta find water and look at that that is an oasis down there if i've ever seen one so let's get down there, and hopefully there's nothing too, you know, dangerous around there. We got ourselves an Ankylosaurus, a Parasaurus, so I think we're going to be safe. Um, I'm trying to scout out, you know, um, yeah, that's not safe up there. If you guys see that, that is definitely a raptor. So if we're going to take on a raptor, we need tools ASAP. So um, let's get on that. And I have the same mods as I do for my other series. So um, we'll just be using all the same things here. I think um, most of those mods are pretty vanilla based anyway. So I don't think it's really going to change much. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and get some tools going. We're going to need a bola here. And then once we get a bola, I think we could kill that raptor. No problem, honestly. So um, get some wood here real quick um ooh, there, yeah here's the cactuses you guys yeah these don't give wood you've got to have the actual trees here and even the trees some of the trees give cactuses there's all kinds of cactus here you know it's a desert so of course there's gonna be but um let's get ourselves a spear going and then what level do we need to be to get the bola Ooh, yeah we're gonna be like level nine or ten to get that bola that's gonna be rough you guys oh boy i don't know if we're gonna be able to take on this raptor you know our best bet is see we got an ankle right here we need that raptor to fight this anklo, and then I think we'll be a-okay. -okay. <laughs> now, I know that's very dangerous sounding, but I need to get to this watering hole. There's no other way for a caveman to survive. That is quite simple, so let's just head on down here. I mean, maybe we can make a little base real quick, you know? Are we high enough to build a base? Oh, I hear something. Oh, yep, that raptor's right there. Let's get up behind the parasaur, at least. Yeah, up here by the Anki. This guy should help us if he comes over here. Um, let's see, though. Do we have... No, we don't have levels yet to make building. We still need another level. Yeah, that raptor's going ham. Ooh, that parasaur might actually scare him away. Ooh, that actually might be well for us, because that parasaur's going to run really far, at least in theory. No, no, he didn't go far. Um... But, um, yeah. Oh, whoa, look at that, you guys. That is not the Oasis or over there, but that is a Titanosaur. I think we've seen a few of those in our other series on uh, the island. So, yeah, that shouldn't be too new to us. Let's just venture our way down into this valley. I need to keep harvesting, and let's get a level up, and then we'll set ourselves up, you know, a little beach bob hut down here and get ourselves going. Ooh, is it started to rain, you guys? Yeah, yeah, it looks like it's starting to rain. Ooh, so I don't even really need to be down here by the oasis right now. But, you know, why not? This is where we're going to make a home, right? So let's head on down here and see if we can't find, you know, a little safe spot. 
There's a little Don't Cures fellow right here. Man, look at this guy. A little green coloring on him there. And that is nice coloring on you. Um, but yeah, let's just set up. Should we get on the little island, you guys? I mean, the island looks nice, but I don't even know if we can get up over there. It looks like I need some kind of stairs maybe to get up there. Let's level ourselves up, though. I'm just going to keep pumping health, you guys, off the start because that is what we're going to need here. We are going to be dying like no tomorrow. So, um... Yeah, learn this stuff, and bada big, bada boom. We should be able to set up a basic little hut. And let me see. Oh, yeah, we can just climb right up that. Well, that's pretty lit. Um, let's see, then. Is this going to be, like, a safe little island? I, I mean, I, I don't know how safe it's going to be, though, because if I can climb right up it, I imagine most dinos are going to be able to do the same. Um, okay, now, here's the part that I definitely cannot climb up. Okay, we might need a build up here, but this I think this will be a good little spot. Let's set up right here, you guys. Um, we got ourselves, you know, a little island seclusion. I think we'll be able to avoid most creatures and at least kind of get a jump on where they are. So, sweet. That's awesome. Do we have the stuff to make this? Um, no, we need some wood. Okay, well, there is some trees over here, luckily. Go ahead and get ourselves some uh, wood. And then we will need a good amount of thatch, of course, so grab some of that as well. And then let's see, do we just, I just want to get like a little house going, maybe like a little uh, two by two. That, that's kind of what I did last series to start. I think we'll do about that, but I'm definitely going to need to get a roof on this one just because of the elements on this world are insane. You cannot be out in the elements. You know, you're going to die. It'll be, end up being too hot or, you know, sometimes it gets too cold because the deserts get real super cold at night. So, yeah, we are going to need to be prepared. For, let's see here. Yeah, we got um, six of those. I think we're going to need two more. And then we're going to need four of them bad boys. Okay, I got five crafting. Um, I can't really cancel the queue until we get down there. So that sucks. But um, either way, let's place these foundations down and get ourselves a little setup going, you guys. I kind of like to be you know, a little centralized here. We can get a look of both sides, if you will. From here to the left and to the right. Yeah, this will work. We can go ahead and chop this cactus tree down right here. We don't need this in our base, of course. <laughs> Prickly little thing. Go ahead and take you out like so. And, um, yeah, then I think we need to go taming something, you guys. I mean, a parasaur would be great to get. But, I mean, if that raptor's still up there, you guys, I would like to tame him by the end of this episode. I'm pretty sure we could do that. I think I need to put the door up here just because the base is so, um, tall on the other side. I don't think I'm going to be able to get in from the other side. Okay, yeah, we're going to need to break that cactus, too. Looks like it, um, is glitching in our base a little bit. Uh-oh. Go ahead and pick that up, replace it down. And then, um, it looks like our walls didn't craft. What happened to the walls? I don't know what's going on there. That, that, that's kind of strange. Um, go ahead and grab some wood is what I think we're missing. Are any of these trees over here? Man, I can't tell, man. I think I gotta get up higher to get the trees. I think I'm almost up here, but I can't really tell exactly if we're gonna be able to get up. Okay, here we go. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, I needed to get up here because we need some more wood, it looks like, to actually make the rest of those um, ceilings. So we'll go ahead and grab it, and then we should be able to get them crafted up. And hey, at least it didn't make the one extra one that I didn't want it to make anyway. So that actually kind of worked out in the end. Okay, we're missing a little bit of fiber now. Well, that ain't no problem. There's bushes all over this island. Let me go ahead and pick a little bit of these bushes, craft some of that up. Bada bing, bada boom. We got ourselves a ceiling, you guys, on our house. And after that, um, I don't know. We're going to see what level we are is probably what I'm going to do. What? How many levels? We gained two levels there. Okay. So we're up to level six now. I don't know what that really unlocks us. Let's check it out. Looks like narcotics, the slingshot. Yeah, nothing really huge yet. I mean, we can make a storage box. We might as well get a storage box rolling if we can afford it. Yeah, we can afford a storage box, so that's good. That way we can store up a little bit of stuff. And can we actually make a bed? Or maybe a sleeping bag at the bare middle? Um, yeah, it looks like we can make a sleeping bag, but if we wait to level 7, we could just get the bed anyway. So I'm just going to wait, and let's go try to kill something here real quick, you guys. Um, throw some junk up in this trunk like a so, because I really don't need any of that on me, and I'd like a little bit of resources to start out again if I die here. Because, you know, there's a good chance of that. <laughs> um, I'm thinking we might need to kill this Parasaur just for the levels. I know I just said I wanted to tame it, but, I mean, let's be realistic. We need to level up right now, and, I mean... I don't think there's anything else I'm going to kill easily, so... What level are you? Le oh, level 15. That's really not a very good tame anyway, so come on. I'm going to have to use your hides. The hide will be good for our bed, too. We are going to need a bed. Go ahead and hit him with some spears. Oh, don't go in the water, man. There's stuff in here. There's bad... There's things in here, man. There, there's definitely some nasty crocodiles in here that I know about. Ooh, jerboas. Man, these little guys, man. These... I, I hate to kill you guys right now. I hate to kill you guys, but we need the hide. Can I, can I get some hides from you guys? Okay, there we go. We got one of them. 
Oh, it was a juvenile? Man, you're making me feel bad now. <laughs> well, either way, um, we got them harvested up. Yep, there we go. Um, so that actually is some hide. And that's actually going to give us the ability to level up. I hear one of these guys purring over here. Which actually means a storm is incoming. Um, I don't know. Should we tame a Jerboa, you guys? I don't... I mean, we just savagely killed that one's family. So we probably shouldn't tame that one. <laughs> um, but here... I think we're going to want some levels in the melee. We're pretty weak here early on. Melee and health, that's definitely what we're going to need. Let's start a campfire. Campfire is definitely not bad to get. And then we'll get the bed, as well as our awesome spyglass. The problem with that awesome spyglass, though, is we're not going to be able to make it until we find some crystal, which is a little unfortunate. Um, so, yeah, there's that. Let's head back to base, because I think a big old storm is about to ensue, you guys. But um, either way, we're about to find out. Let's try to get up here, though. Let's try to get back up here. We're going to need to make ourselves some kind of stairs on this or something eventually, you guys. Man, this is what a hassle of a thing to get up and down. I can tell you that much. Dang, man, you guys. I don't know if I can get up. Um, we might need to build some stairs. Can we build, like, a ramp real quick or no? Yeah, we could just build some stairs up and down. That might be the best bet. Um, and unfortunately, we are starving now, and we're not up at the top of our base. Oh, wait, here we go. I'm making a little progress. Oh, oh. I think I got it. Yep, I got it, you guys. I think we're up. Heck yeah. Okay, now we just need to get up the second shelf. But I think this one's a tad bit easier. And actually, while we're down here, destroy this cactus. Because, yeah, this was glitching into our house. Go ahead and take this down like a so. Bada bing, bada boom, or no? Is it, man, this thing is taking forever to destroy. Okay, there we go. We finally got that thing broken down. Okay, this side, like, yeah, this looks a lot easier to cross up right here. That is good. Okay, sweet. All right, let's set up a campfire. What in the world? Are these tumbleweeds? Dude, these are like tumble... How did I get a tumbleweed in my base, you guys? What in the world? Is that what this is? I, I think that's what's going on here. I don't know how to get rid of this, though. This is something new for sure. Um, I don't even know if I'm harvesting it, honestly. So either way, let's just stop. I guess there's a tumbleweed in our house today. <laughs> um, yeah, let's grab the stuff out of the chest. That should actually be everything to craft a campfire. Sweet. And then what do we need to get a bed? We need a little more hide. Dang, you guys. Okay, we're going to have to go kill something else here. Let's place our fire outside. Don't casually burn our house down, you know. At least it's not like green hell, you know, where our campfire is going to go out in the rain. Hey, I mean, I guess it's realistic, but, you know, it, it does make surviving quite a bit harder. Um, yeah, we need to find something to kill. I don't know where that parasaur went, you guys. That thing would have been a real easy kill early on, so I'm kind of sad that thing got away. Um, I see the Dodecurus over there. He's definitely not going to be something we're going to be able to kill early on. Um, so, yeah, you know, we're probably just going to go Jerbo <laughs> Jerboa slaying, because that is probably our only option, honestly, at this point. So we'll go ahead and do some of that action. Give me a piece of food. We'll throw some thatch up in here, because that stuff, yeah, the thing just ran out. Um, but we don't want to put that much up in there. I don't want to cook all of my thatch up casually. 22 should do it good, though. Yeah, there we go. Bada bing, bada boom. Let's head out. And actually, while we're up here, can we make ourselves that? Okay, no, we need wood. Let's go grab some wood, and we're going to build some stairs so we don't have to deal with this hassle of getting up and down that cliff anymore. Oh, boy, and I just heard a, an aggressive-sounding growl. I do not know where that came from. Maybe it was just the Dota Curious up here making noises. Who knows? Either way... Grab a little bit of wood, we'll make up some stairs, and I'm still waiting, you know, to find something to tame here. Fortunately, we haven't really spotted anything like that early on. I mean, we got, the Parasaur just wasn't high enough level. If it was a high level, we're talking like 100 plus, I think I would have tamed that Parasaur. But it, okay, here we are. Well, speaking of such, what level are you? Um, level 70, I mean, that's pretty good. What are you over here? Uh, let me check you out. Um... Level 15? Okay, you're the one that got away. I mean, definitely. That is definitely the one that ran away from me. Not gonna lie, I think we should kill that one. Just because it looks cornered right now. And there's no way we're knocking out a level 70 without a bola. We need to get this Parasaur down. It's gonna give us levels. It's gonna give us all kinds of things. Um, okay, I think we hit him. Did we hit him? Okay, oh, we definitely hit him there. Nice, you guys. We got ourselves the Parasaur down. And it looks like our spear broke in that process. So we're gonna need to make a new one of those up. And I think those Jerboros prowling or growling that we heard earlier was actually just them growling for the um, storm thing. Ooh, let's go ahead and get rid of that trash real quick. No need to see that. Alrighty, you guys. Well, we got a level up there, and we, um, we got the wood to make those ramps. So let's go ahead and do that. And actually, making the ramps will probably level us up. Another level up. Um, actually, I don't know. We do need to level up first to see how close we are to doing that. But I would bet it would. And if it doesn't, we'll just craft more stuff. <laughs> so um, either way... 
Head down here. Ooh, this little guy. Man, I hate to kill you. But man, everything early game, dude, we gotta take advantage, you know, we need our resources right now, so, every little animal, man, I hate to do it, we need your hide, though, um, and, um, let's just head back to base here, get ourselves a drink of water, and see if we can place these ramps, we might actually need more than two of them, I really don't know how many we're gonna need, or if I'm gonna be able to place them from down here, I might actually need to be able to lay, I might actually need to get all the way up there to place them. I don't think I'll be able to place them from this bottom shelf. Oh, wow, look at that, you guys. So it looks like I can actually place it from here. But I don't know if that's going to be good enough to um, snap to it from here, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know how this is going to work from here. If we need to just build ceilings from there, or if I could just snap this. Um, yeah, that's looking quite weird, honestly. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, yeah, that's just not how I want it. I think we definitely need to get up there, you guys. So let's get up there real quick. We're up here, you know. It took, you know, a long, lot longer. <laughs> it took a lot longer than it probably should have. But let's go ahead and build out from here. Um, let's put a foundation here. Yeah, if we put a foundation here, then that should be even better. I think we can actually cactus sap. Yeah, that gives us a good amount of food. Let's go ahead and down some cactus sap. Bada bing, bada boom. It actually gives us water, too. So, hey, that's pretty good. Go ahead and place this down. Yeah, I think it snaps. Yeah, it snaps to that. And then from here, do we want stairs? Oop, accidentally ate that raw meat. Did not want to do that. And we, I don't think we want stairs here. I think we want to either build another foundation out and then build the stairs. Yeah, that's definitely what we're going to want to do from here. So let's go ahead and do some of that action. Build a foundation, and then build stairs, and then I think we might need another set. I mean, we might just make a bridge at this point. Let's just make a bridge at this point, you guys, honestly. I'm just going to see if... I think we can. I think we might run out of snap connection point. And I, I don't know, I, that's definitely not the word for it, but I think we're going to run out of you know, points to snap to before, and I might need to build pillars, and I just don't think I'm high enough level to build pillars yet. But... I'll see. We'll see, right? Um, I can place that, so that's a good sign. Um, we can place that one. I think at this point, if we place the stairs, we would be good. Ooh, but see, this is where we run into it, yeah. So, um, for now, yeah, we're just going to pick up the bridge. The bridge is a great idea. We'll probably do it here in an episode, like an episode beyond now, but i just not high enough level now. All right, yeah, we're just going to go ahead and place these stairs down here because I'm not high enough level to, you know, unlock that pillar. And we need a little bit more. Was that thatch or wood? I already forgot. <laughs> I think it was wood, yeah. We needed both, actually. Well, that's unfortunate. Let's go ahead and pick this wall up and replace it with a door since we now have kind of an entryway on both sides, which is pretty lit, right? Um, That's not what we want to do. Yeah, we want to get a different snap point. There we go. Bada bing, bada boom. And then last step, I think, is to actually get some doors on this house. Just because if something attacks, it might actually get through the door. So <laughs> put a door up. And then um, let's go ahead and grab our food. And am I high enough for a bola yet? That's really been the entire, you know, progress here of episode one. Can we get the bola? Oh my gosh, you guys. We can make a bola, but we can't make the reusable one. So do we want to try to get higher level? I think we do. Let's try to break some stuff. See if we can't get up to the next level. Let's go ahead and put our food down here. I think we need to make another spear. Yeah, we need to make a lot more things. So real quick, just throw up some trash into the house. And then let's go out, make up a few things. And after we craft that stuff, we should actually become high enough level to therefore make the reusable bola. And yeah, that'll be pretty dink. So we'll go ahead and do that. Put the prime meat up. That's probably our uh, most valuable thing. And um, so yeah, jump. And we are going to need to place, yeah, another set of stairs on that. So make that as long as with a spear. We should be good to go. Oh, man. Um, what is that? What is that? Uh, okay, that's definitely just the Dota Curious Ground. Man, that thing has scared me every time. That thing makes such aggressive sounds for some reason. Um, and let's see. Can we kill one of these insects, actually? Let's try to kill him. Oh, my spear broke instantly. Um, well, he doesn't attack, so that's great. Oh, here's a little another Jerboa fella. You know, you know, we do need a Jerbo fella. I really want to slay him, but we need one of these guys at the same time because they're actually helpful for telling you when storms come. So, um, yeah, there we go. We went ahead and knocked him out. Oh, some berries up in him. We should be good to go, just like so. And, um, yeah, let's see. Can we kill this jug bug if I throw my spear at it? Oh, this isn't a jug bug. <laughs> that's the whole, uh, that's the whole Dota Curious. Okay, well, we have ourselves a Parasaur there. I do kind of want to tame that one. Um, but, um, we, we need to get the bola here. Let's make that, and then what do we need to make the spears? We need a little bit of wood, and we should be good to go. Alrighty, we should have enough wood. Now you guys make ourselves another set of spears. Um, and uh, I guess I, we could just learn cloth hats and craft cloth hats for the last bit of our levels. I mean, everyone knows that classic arc trick, right? So let's go ahead and do that, and get up to level 10, make these reusable bolas. You know, I think it's kind of weird how the reusable bolas, for some reason, a whole level after... The normal boa. I just think that's kind of strange. But hey, what does it really matter, right? We'll get there anyway. 
Um, and then actually, yeah, we need to make those stairs for our house. So bada bing, bada boom, we got those crafting as well. And actually, we'll craft those first just because that might give me the level. I doubt it will, but we want to get that done first and then craft the hats. There we go. Sweet. And this gerbo is about to tame up. Oh, boy, you guys are about to get ourselves our first tame, a female gerbo, a level 20. Super awesome. Yep, there we go, you guys. Um, Let me go ahead and put him over here, or her over here, kind of in the... You know, sun where you can see her a bit better. Yeah, she's purring and stuff. I think that means a storm's coming. Yeah, there she kind of got stripes on her, a little brown and black going on. Pretty cool coloring, right? Go ahead and leave some names down below in the comments. We'll be naming her up next episode. But um, yeah, we are about to level up. It should actually be this next hat. We can go ahead and equip that hat. And then yeah, cancel the queue. We do not need any of these cloth hats, you guys. We're simply just doing it for the levels. So drop that trash. And put a level into melee, and we should be able to get ourselves the reusable bola. Ooh, and I wanted to get the bow too, but dang, we um, yeah, we need to learn the slingshot, and then we don't have enough points to then there learn the bow. That's unfortunate. So um, get the bola though crafted, and then we are going to be in a lot better situation. We just need a little bit of fiber and then some rocks. Is there any rocks kind of on the beach over here? Uh, I don't. This is really the beach, but um, you know, the, the water's edge. I guess we're just going to have to hit one of these things. Like right, so. And then we should have enough now. There we go. Sweet, you guys. A reusable bola. And you know what I'm doing now. There was a raptor out over here. Yes, that's right. Let's go ahead and see if we can um, try to do some things with that raptor. Now, I do want to get a bed first. That would be smart. And actually, let's definitely get a bed first because we can afford everything to get the bed. Oh, no. Oh, man, you guys. Yeah, this went bad really quickly. Man, I think this is a sandstorm. Yeah, we are going to need to get inside ASAP. Oh, boy. Yeah, this is bad. This is bad. Put up our um, uh, upstairs. There we go. Sweet. Now we can get up to our thing easily in a hurry. That's good. We got this set up. Yeah, this is a straight-up sandstorm, you guys. This is dangerous as all heck. Um, where's our doors? Yeah, we never put our doors up. Let's go ahead and put our doors up on the house. There we go. Man, you guys, we might have to wait out this sandstorm. <coughs> yeah, I can barely breathe out here. <coughs> yeah, close that door. Oh, man, you guys. Yeah, that is hectic out there. I think we are going to have to wait out the storm. Luckily, we do have some food. And um, let's see. Can we craft anything while we're waiting in here? Man, they added all these new skins, you guys. I really don't know, what's, you know what these are all about. But, heck, we might as well learn them all, right? Like a so, and then um yeah we'll get our quality of life tools just like we have from our other series. Yeah, they got all these brand new skins. For some reason, they have you learn these. Maybe because they're craftable. Ooh, yeah, I didn't think of that. They have you learn them because they're actually craftable skins as opposed to you have to find them. So that's actually really awesome. I like that a lot. Um, a reusable torch. Um, I don't think we really need that. Um, yeah, I don't want to really spend my points here necessarily. I just don't know what to spend them on, you know what I'm saying? There's a lot of, um... We definitely want to get the arrow here. Actually, let's get the boomerang, you guys, because the boomerang is actually going to be a handy little tool here in the desert. Yeah, that cluttered up our inventory here, but you know what? How about we make some of these? So we could make an outlaw pants. We could make... Yeah, do we want to be an outlaw? Do we want to be a rancher? A drifter? Okay, they have a whole bunch of things. These aren't really sorted here. Yeah, I can see them a lot better in here. Okay, desert ghillie, drifter outlaw and then okay the rancher hat is part of the drifter set it looks like oh no they have a drifter's hat okay it just looks like they've got a whole rancher hat no rancher set okay well out of all the hats in there you guys i don't know what about y'all but i think i'm gonna be an outlaw i'm feeling the outlaw setup so let's go ahead and make some of that up what an outlaw shirt outlaw pants and how about an outlaw hat while we're at it there we go you guys and um i don't know if i can actually hide my hat so it just shows my you know hair all the time because i kind of want to do that but um Either way, yeah, I don't know how to do that. If you guys know, let me know down in the comments. Um, but um, either way, let's go ahead and equip these cosmetics like us. So, yeah, we could check out ourselves, you guys. Man, look at... Ooh, we even got a little mask on and everything. Man, maybe we could go out in the storm now. I don't know how that really works. I doubt it. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah, we could definitely not go in. It's a casual sandstorm out here right now, you guys. We do not stand a chance out here right now. Well, I went ahead and sorted my inventory out, you guys. I don't really know how long this storm here is going to last, but I guess we're just going to go ahead and wait it out and 
we'll see what's going on. Hopefully, you know, it doesn't take too long. But um, either way, I'll see you guys here in just a bit. So, you guys, while I'm waiting here, I'm actually going to go ahead and craft up cloth hats so we can keep leveling up. Because they only take 10 fiber and they give you a good amount of levels. So, while we're sitting here waiting, I'm just going to keep crafting those up. And we'll see how many level ups we get. But, um... Either way, see you guys here in just a bit. Well, you guys, I really don't think this sandstorm is going to end. It's been going on for forever, and on top of that, a heat wave started. As you can see, that little fire red symbol in the bottom there, so I can't even go outside without, you know, dying and getting thirsty like cr crazy. So I'm just going to go ahead and wait out the rest of this storm. And um, I've just been crafting these hats off camera, and it's just been getting me a ton of level ups. So I'm going to keep doing that. And um, next episode, you know, we'll start it out here with a bunch of level ups, hopefully. So that'll be, you know, a good way to jump start here in the next episode but um either way stay tuned for that and thank you guys all very much for watching and i'll see you guys here next time with some more scorched earth and uh, of course leave some names down below for our little jer burrow fellow here you know a little uh shoulder buddy he could just sit on my shoulder he's quite a great little dude but um either way yeah leave some names down below for him and i'll see you guys here next time oh bye there